Hello everybody, my name is Tycho67, and welcome to another video. <sighs> this is about Modern Warfare, okay? This is not really a rant, this is not really anything. But it's just me telling you guys what's going to happen on the channel. Now, did I pre-order Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2019? Yes. <laughs> Am I going to cancel the pre-order? Fuck no. Because I never do. This is my second game that I pre-ordered. I've never pre-ordered any Call of Duty games ever. And the first game I ever pre-ordered from Call of Duty was Black Ops 4 back in November of 2018. Now, let's get one thing straight, okay? Call of Duty Black Ops 4 was such a solid game when it came out into the, uh, in November, okay? From November to December. Or no, from November... Well, throughout November. But I... <sighs> I had so much fun with the game, there was no microtransactions, there was literally nothing, but I got gold for the ICR, because the ICR back when it came out, fucking OP as shit, so it was a Stripe, and I recently got the Stripe gold, and I'm thinking about getting all uh, pistols gold, so I can have diamond. Now, recently, Black Ops 4 has released microtransactions, and they pay to win bullshit that they've been doing. Now, Activision... Is fucking us. They've always fucked us. But now they came out with this thing today. Where it's uh, the Activision 40th anniversary from 1979-2019. Where they came out with calling cards. That's not bad. I like that. I always enjoyed Activision's games from like the 70s. From, you know. From, yeah. <laughs> they, they made a lot of games, surprisingly. They made one of my favorite games of all time. And I forget what the name is. But it involves spaceships. Space Invaders. Yeah. But... Let's just say that Activision has taken over Call of Duty back, way back when, when Call of Duty was so simple. Call of Duty 4. There was no microtransactions whatsoever. It was a good game. It had good, uh, a, a solid campaign, solid multiplayer, and I'm pretty sure it was Spec Ops, if I remember. Modern Warfare 2. No microtransactions. Modern Warfare 3. Mon Mon <laughs> Modern Warfare 3 had Spec Ops, and that's what they're coming out with in 2019 Modern Warfare. And then Black Ops came out. No microtransactions. Black Ops 2, a little futuristic. No microtransactions. And then Ghost came out. Well, they well they all kind of had microtransactions in a way, but there's only certain things you buy, like calling cards and guns that were useless. Like Black Ops 2's Peacekeeper, that gun sucked ass, and I never even bought it. My brother had it. I only had certain types of maps, like Buried and fucking Nuketown. <laughs> I still don't have maps, but <sighs> fucking then Advanced Warfare came out, and that's where they introduced supply drops, fucking exo jump, more futuristic shit. Advanced Warfare sucked ass, and my buddy Paul enjoyed it. Black Ops Three came out, it sucked ass too. I hated every second of it. I hated the zombies. I hated the multiplayer. I I don't even play the campaign nowadays. The multiplayer is not bad. It comes with crypto keys. That's what Black Ops 4 went wrong with. They have a tier system that literally takes fucking 60,000 hours just to get to the next tier. You'll be on one tier and then you'll be fucking at five. And when you're at five, it takes five more minutes, five more fucking hours for you to get to six. <laughs> but they need to come back. Okay, crypto keys was cool. It was a cool thing for Black Ops 3. Instead of fucking buying supply drops, you could unlock them a lot more faster with crypto keys. And zombies, zombies was my favorite. And zombies still my favorite. Uh, when I get, I pre-ordered Modern Warfare. When I get that game, I'm completely deleting Black Ops Four. I had to buy. Literally, it took me so long on a tier system. I literally bought half of them. I'm on tier forty six or something. And I don't know why I did it, but I did it, and I spent more money on a fucking tier system, which I shouldn't have done. And I think I'm done with that. And when Modern Warfare comes out, and I play it, and I know for a fucking fact that there will be microtransactions. And I'm going to completely delete Black Ops 4, because when I pre-ordered Black Ops 4, it was a solid game when it came out. And then and then 2019, microtransactions was just a big fucking abomination. And now, the game is such utter shit, and you guys seen me play it, you see me live streaming, you see me rage. That is 100% real rage, because that really pisses me off. It's the fact that when you look around behind you, and there's no one there, you turn your back for one second, and you get shot at. 
complete bullshit. All the fucking weapons in it are more, more overpowered. And when I get to that damn fucking, what the hell is it called? Weapon bribe. And watch me get something that I don't even want. I got the freaking worst guns. The Rampage is a shotgun. Full auto shotgun. I don't even have half of it unlocked because it's such shit. The fucking ballistic knife. I got that max because I play sticks and stones. It was good in Sticks and Stones. It is not good in Team Deathmatch. And I play a lot of hardcore TDM. And a lot of hard. I play mainly hardcore. I don't really play core anymore. I used to play core back in, back in the day, like when I quick scope in Black in uh, Modern Warfare Two. That's where I started quick scoping it. And I gotta say, from Modern Warfare Two, all the way to Black Ops Four, I have this big fucking distance right here. Well, Modern Warfare 2 was a good game. It has a solid campaign. It's one of my favorite games of all time. I love Black Ops 1's zombies. I like Black Ops 2's campaign. I like Black Ops 3's zombies. Fuck Infinite Warfare. Piece of shit. World War 2's a piece of shit, too. Sledgehammer Games is no longer making games, apparently. So now it's back to the same shit where it was Treyarch, Infinity Ward. Treyarch, Infinity Ward. And Infinity Ward, ever since Ghost came out... Okay, let's get things straight. Ghost campaign was solid. It was a good campaign. The multiplayer, uh, the, the fucking aliens, that was the worst fucking idea on, my, on the planet. But, this is an uncut video as usual. But, listen, fucking Modern Warfare, people talk about Modern Warfare where it's like, don't buy the game, don't do this, don't do that. I understand, but I am buying the game no matter what, I want to see for myself. And I know for a fact that it is crossplay, but the one thing that does suck for me, that Spec Ops, it's only for one year. One fucking year for PlayStation, so I can't really play with my friends. Half my friends are on PC, half my friends are on Xbox. Fucking half my friends are on PlayStation, so me, maybe some of my friends like uh, Makeshift Nexus, me and him will play. Me and Eddie, fucking, he'd be on PC mainly, and we'd be playing multiplayer, and plus I will be doing a live stream on, on the entire campaign, probably a full let's play, who knows. Fucking, it's a lot. <laughs> mm -mm. But I did get this badass uh, dynamic theme. From Modern Warfare, when you pre-order it, you get the dynamic theme instantly. And you know what else happened? I spent $63, because PlayStation has tax, apparently. I spent $63 on the original game. And you know how you go on Amazon, you purchase something, and then it shows you more shit that are cheaper? Well, PlayStation fucking did that to me. I pre-ordered the game for $63, and then it popped up a discount of the Operator Enhanced Edition, the $120 edition, $40. Isn't that some fuckery? And watch it, 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 it fucking PlayStation, it just motherfuckers. <laughs> mm. I know this video is long. It is kind of a rant. I shouldn't have said this is not a rant, but apparently this is a fucking rant because Call of Duty is fucking up and they will continue fucking up because. Fucking Activision. Mainly Activision. I know it's probably Treyarch's fault, because look at Treyarch. Black Ops 4 started with camos and guns. And now we're getting camos and guns behind supply drops. And loot boxes, whatever the fuck you got. I call it supply drops. Behind supply drops. And the tier system is such shit that literally they had to put... They didn't, ha they didn't have no freaking specialists for the last operation. Which is weird, because I'd rather have a new op operator than fucking Zero. Because <laughs> she don't do shit. But, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, it was, um... The tier system now is just the beginning. Stickers. It's mainly stickers, gestures, calling cards. Barely calling cards, actually. Emblems, mainly. And then you get the Mastercraft for the BK something, which... I hate using. And then you skip over and you got weapon. You got, no, no, you don't got weapons. Never mind. You got fucking outfits. Like, I don't give a shit about outfits. I care about guns more. I like calling cards. I like emblems. But I don't want them 24-7. And then at the end, at tier 50, you get a weapon bribe. And yes, I want to get the weapon bribe because really, I just want to fucking get a gun. 
a gun for fuck's sake. I mean, look at Black Ops 3. I didn't, I barely got any guns. Not real re recently. I wanted to get a gun and I finally got the AK-74U. Have I used it? Fuck yeah, it's a good gun. But I mainly got the freaking, mainly melee weapons. And it's fucking bullshit. Hmm. But it happened. But, I don't know what to say about Call of Duty, honestly. I think they're going to shit. And recently, I'm going to buy Rainbow Six Siege. Like, I have it. I have it right here. And I can play it on Xbox, but I can't live stream on Xbox. If you guys want to see me live streaming on Xbox, so go to Mixer. My name is Tycho67 on there. Watch some gameplay. I play Blair Witch. I got a couple videos on there. So, go check it out. It's pretty good. Scooby-Doo uh, Night of 100 Frights. The glitches will be coming out soon. I actually got a video on it already, and I don't know if I posted it or not. Um, Mystery Mayhem coming out soon. Unmasked coming out soon. Um, maybe some Guitar Hero, Sly Cooper, stuff like that. And uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Love you all to death. Have a fantastic day. Leave a like, comment down below. Peace.